Yes, um, well, the purple poppy is an extremely important emblem. Um, it was founded actually in 2016. The Murphy's Army Purple Poppy campaign was when it really came to the fore. Purple has always been used as a colour of remembrance. Um, but as you can see, Gracie this morning is sporting her purple poppy. And it's very much in remembrance of the animals who have given their all in times of conflict as well isn't it not just dogs as we can see i mean everything almost from horses to carrier pigeons well it is i mean horses played a huge role in times of conflict and of course you know we remember the first world war um but it's also uh, over millennia i mean you think of the battle of waterloo um battles going further back horses have been an extraordinary important part of um you go down gracie um uh, Horses have been an extraordinary important part of uh, of conflict because of the job that they have done. And of course, you've got dogs with messengering, you've got pigeons messengering, you've got dogs comforting wounded soldiers. Their their role is enormous. Um, I'm a great animal lover, so I'm asking this um, <laughs> just to play the other side of the coin, if you like, because there will be some people thinking, well, do we need to pay tribute to these animals because they're not doing it themselves. They have no sense of service or sacrifice, do they? They're doing what they are required to do by their human masters. Stephen, I think you've got it just there. You say that they are not aware of what they're doing, um, whereas most soldiers and humans, we have the emotional side of of. of of what we're doing and we're very aware of what we're doing yet d dogs and horses carrier pigeons whatever animal that may be they don't know where they're going so if you can imagine in a time of conflict you've got shells going off you've got sniper fire you've got noise and chaos all around you as human beings we know what that means we know that it's because we're being shot at whereas if you can imagine a horse um in the first world war at the battle of ypres for, for, for instance um, they would just be absolutely terrified and they don't have the choice um, as to why they're going to war. They're just taken there.